My name is Georgi Badridze. I'm the ambassador of Georgia uh, to the United Kingdom. Well, first of all, I would like to thank the university uh, for organizing this fantastic conference that was largely dedicated to the Caucasus, uh, a region of the world which is widely uh, understudied, I would say, uh, but uh, its significance is, is uh, being realized these days, uh, particularly uh, when we talk about my country, Georgia, which is in the heart of the Caucasus, and its role in terms of providing an example of successful uh, economic and democratic reforms, uh, providing a very important segment of the southern corridor, energy corridor, which, mm, which ensures the energy security, uh, I think the uh, region uh, will attract more uh, attention. I, it, it is academically understudied and uh, I'm very grateful to the great department of uh, Russian and Eastern European studies for taking the interest and for developing uh, their research. And this conference reflected a wide range of issues that probably will will be um, a, will become a subject of more in-depth studies in the future. Georgia uh, and, and the Caucasus uh, in general is not the best known uh, and most widely known uh, area. Uh, although uh, Georgia and the Caucasus has a very, very old and huge history. Georgia alone has a 3,000 year old uh, history of statehood. But for the last few hundred years, Georgia has been cut off the rest of Europe. Uh, the story of Georgia today is uh, about its attempt to reunite with Europe, where most Georgians believe we belong. Uh, in the medieval part, past, Georgians uh, try to uh, reach Europe uh, politically and economically because of the common uh, Christian uh, faith. And the modern Georgians, they believe they belong in Europe because of the uh, common values that we share with Europe. So uh, many, many people who attended this conference probably heard quite a few new stories of which they were not aware.